Hi Aquarius, welcome to Heaven Healing and Tarot. This is Christina. Today we'll be getting you some messages. Um, let's just see what's going on in your energy and what advice maybe your angels and guides want to tell you at this time. Before I do that though, I always send out some healing. So take a deep breath with me. You ready? Here we go. All right, Aquarius, let's jump in and get your cards. Two of Swords. Eight of Pentacles. The Lovers. Four of Cups. Two of Cups. Well, Aquarius, what's going on? One, like, I don't know, you got these really good cards here. You got the lovers, you got two of cups. That means you're definitely dealing with soulmate energy here, but I'm kind of getting a, like a sad vibe from this. Not, I mean, not a, normally that would be like giving me very, that, that's ghost. Ghost never barks first. Anyway. Um, I'm getting a very sad vibe, <laughs> but I have to put you on hold. Hold on. Okay. We'll see what happens. Anyway. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I, I, I feel like you're... Anyway, I don't know. I'm, I'm getting lost in my train of thought here because I'm trying to feel what I'm feeling here. Like normally the, the lovers and the two of cups would be like, oh my God, um, you know, if you're not with your soulmate, your soulmate's coming in. But here I feel like you're not happy with your soulmate and you're trying to make a decision here and you're really, You know, you're putting the work in, it feels like. You're putting the work in, but maybe you don't feel like you're getting what equal give and take here. Maybe you don't feel like you're you're getting what you want back. But these are this is something for somebody who's already in a relationship here. If you're not in a relationship and you're looking for love, I feel like you're not you have options, but you're you're not satisfied with your options but they're saying that it's a soulmate here you are dealing with a soulmate so something's off I just feel like something is off here either either you're not giving your soulmate a chance or your soulmate's not being good to you right now I don't know I'm I'm not sure what I'm feeling here, Aquarius. So let's just get some more cards. This is a tough one for me. Got the Hermit. Seven of Wands. Empress. And Nine of Swords. Yeah. I, I, I feel like you are like... I think you're really questioning. Is this worth it? You are... You're... Uh, looking for answers with this uh, hermit card. You're like really questioning things. You're really trying to decide something. They're telling you to stand your ground. Don't give up on what you want. You're the empress. You are very fertile. You can have whatever it is that you want. You make dreams come true. You make things come reality. You are um, very capable. But you are definitely, definitely having major anxiety over some things. You're really trying to decide something. And it could be a choice between two. You know, you could have options in love here. You, you could be choosing between two. Because you're just not satisfied with the way things are going. And I don't know. Or you might not be satisfied with one of the choices. You know, I, I feel like you should be celebrating right now. You should be celebrating love, but you're, you're not. 
And you're trying to come, you're trying to make a decision here. You're trying to figure out what to do. All right, let's get some more cards here. Your children are watched over by angels. Oh, that's amazing. I mean, we all are, right? But um, to, just to have that confirmation that your, your kids are safe, right? Your kids are being protected. So if your kids are going through something right now, don't worry about them. Spirits got their back. They're, you know, if they're, if they're dealing with something, um, they're going to be okay. Okay. What's happening is happening for their highest good as well. So just know that your, your children are definitely very protected at this time. Soul family, call in your tribe. You don't have to do it alone. So I, yeah. I feel, I feel like you're struggling with something here. Um, and this is saying that you have a soul tribe. So call on one of them or, or all of them if you have to, um, you know, to help you get through this. Whatever this is, help you make your decision, help you, you know, figure things out. Maybe they, they can see things from a different perspective than you. You're going to get inspiration, right? So maybe you are meditating here. I don't know if you can see that because of the light. But, um, you know, maybe you're meditating here, connecting, trying to get some answers. Um, inspiration is going to come. You're going to know what to do. You're going to have that inspiration. All right, let's see. Experiments, forcing change, cruelty in the pursuit of knowledge, arrogance. I feel like somebody's trying to like force you to do something you don't want to do. Like, and I don't feel like it's anything that's going to hurt you physically. So I'm, I'm not talking about that um I, I feel like you're dealing with somebody who's arrogant who is full of themselves who it's their way or the highway and they are trying to get you to do something that they want you to do i feel like it's like a life path i don't feel like it's like something that'll cause you harm at least i hope not um i guess it could but I'm feeling like it's they're, they're trying to get you to choose the way that they want you to go and where you're feeling drawn or pulled to, to a different, a different, in a different direction. Am I making any sense? This is a tough one, Aquarius. I, I feel like somebody is trying to get you to do things for their, the way they, they want for their own selfish reasons. Okay, so they want you to do it because it'll benefit them. It'll make them happy. and But you're kind of leaning towards a different route. Aquarius, all I can say is you got to live life for you, not for somebody else. So you got to do what makes you happy, right? Choose the path that's right for you. And if that means choose the person that's right for you, you need to do that as well. Right? Because you do have prosperity that lies ahead. So... You do have good things coming in for you. Reconciliation. All right. So I feel like things are going to come to. Um, I got froggy. Sorry. Allergies. It rained all day yesterday. It was not all day, but it rained a lot. But anyway. Um, reconciliation. You're, you're going to. You're. You, you guys are going to be okay. You guys are, you know, there's going to be an apology. There's going to be, um, you know, a meeting of the minds. I feel like things are going to work out. So I feel like this tough time is temporary. Um, I do feel like you're going to be fine. That's good. That's good. Either that or somebody from a past life or, 
or even this life is coming back into your life and you're going to, you know, have a reunion here of some sort. So maybe that's the decision. Maybe somebody from your past is returning. So maybe that's what's causing all this indecisiveness. Maybe that's a decision you have to make. I don't know, you're losing sleep though, and I, I wanna say you're okay, you're gonna be okay. You may not always understand why certain things happen. However, there is a higher purpose to the events in your life. And through turmoil, a blessing will be revealed. So, you know, sometimes our life has to go in tur turmoil. Sometimes we have to um, get that, you know, that, um, can't think of the word I'm trying to it starts with a C and I can't think of it but I don't want to say conflict but sometimes we have to 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 see what we don't want in order to know what we do want so sometimes things have to be thrown in our face right but this card is telling me stand your ground you're going to get what you want as long as you stand your ground don't be bullied or manipulated here I I I, I don't want you to do that <laughs> um Interesting. Review and reflection. Oh, yeah, this is Hermit Mode again. This is the Hermit Mode card. So it's time for some reflection. It's time to figure out what you want. You got to do what's right for you and not, not be manipulated by somebody else for their highest good. You got to do what's right for your highest good. And somebody definitely could be returning from your life. You could have a choice between two lovers here. But you're definitely, there is definitely soulmate energy here. And I don't know, like I feel better about it now. Even though I know that you have a difficult decision to make and you're really contemplating things, I do feel like you do have a, a soulmate here who wants what's best for you. So, um, yeah, maybe call on your soul tribe and uh, help figure, help let them help you figure this out. All right, let's pull you some charms. All right, what do we got here? Yeah, you're trying to, you're really trying to figure things out, but you need to face your fears, okay? You have the moon, the moon charm. And I really think it's time for you to just face the fears. A change is happening here. And you got... But look, Cupid's here too. So you definitely, you definitely have love here. They're definitely coming in. Okay, you have the shooting star here. So that means that um, you're going to have a wish come true. So maybe this person returning is your wish come true. Maybe that's who you've been wanting. And Cupid's here to, uh, you know, shoot his hours of love. I do feel really good energy from this one, but yeah, I don't know. You have a choice. Look, it's on your side, though. So go with it. Look, more transformation. A change is happening for you. So either you're going through a transformation, some kind of a change, or you're, one of your persons is going through a change, went through a change. Right? Look, this might be somebody from childhood. Got Hello Kitty here. And... Hello Kitty was from my childhood. It was really big when I was a kid in the 80s. And um, so this person that's returning from your past could be either, it could even be a childhood friend, but it could be definitely somebody you knew in childhood. Um, there's definitely soulmate energy here. You got tip double hearts. And more change, more transformation. Somebody's definitely changing. You got music here, so listen to your sign, listen to music, listen to the messages that you might be getting from spirit through songs. You got a movement charm here. It's a slow movement charm, but you got a movement charm here. And you got the sea turtle. So the sea turtles, sea turtles are so strong, right? 
they they they're survivors they they struggle to survive but they do it they're strong they're stronger than they realize and that's what you are you're stronger than you realize so um hang in there right because you do have something really great here you do have soulmate energy here and there's love so i i think things are going to work out for you i feel like you might have a difficult decision but once you make your decision you're going to be okay i feel much better than i did in the beginning much better so everything happens for a reason and uh prosperity lies ahead so look forward to that okay Aquarius that's all I got for you do what's right for you okay um give the video a like and if you haven't subscribed subscribe to the channel because that'll help me a lot make me very grateful and until next time love and light